Oh man, Chaos would have wrecked this human team. But as it is, humans are probably a good team to beat ogres with because they've got plenty of block, tackle, mighty blow, and speed and dodge. This is probably going to be a horrible match. But hopefully, he's got a shit record. Yes. And hopefully, he'll concede. Oh, he conceded against the Big Butt Brothers. So, there's hope. Let's hope the Big Butt Brothers got him. He conceded while he was winning. Oh, he just lost 3-1. Fair enough. He's only conceded one game. <laughs> I know they're called fearless. Fearless fishermen, but they weren't that fearless when confronted by some rowdy broger men. Um, no, I'm just going to fucking hope, hope he concedes. It's better than Ogres. Oh, fair enough. <laughs> Hello, super, super mega ultra VIP last frog man. Uh, the the record is five three three pseudonym. It should be seven two two. Honestly, got robbed today twice. Got robbed today absolutely twice. Robbed. Um, it was unbelievable. Three plus to win the game. Pick ups and score. Three plus to pick up and score. Roll the two. He he just dodges in. Makes a bunch of dodges. Pick ups. Long bombs it, catches it, GFI scores, and lose the game. It should have been a win for sure. The other one, fair enough, being a draw, but that one should have been a fucking win for sure. At least. At least that one should have been. I fucking lost the toss. Bangor's the chance of him conceding then, I guess. Disappointing. Block tackle over. <laughs> it's fucking funny. I forgot I fucking got it saved, haven't I? I'm wasting all this fucking time. Right, try and override it. Probably won't work. I stay oh, skin. It's my sugar. Probably so. The last frog man. I mean, he fucking does have a chance, doesn't he? It is against Ogres. We should win the toss, though. Winning the toss would have had the best chance of him conceding, wouldn't it? Aha, thank God he goes to the Dodd. The Dodd School of LOS blocking. What is this? What is what is this? Like seriously, right? I'm just gonna do a fucking a fucking video on YouTube where I block with the guy with my E blow and don't block with guys without my E blow. And <laughs> say so what is like what even is this fucking Dodd school of not blocking with your mighty blow guys? I just can't fathom it. Why we... <laughs> What's up, man? What is up with these people taking mighty... Like, how do you take mighty blow as a skill and then don't hit with it? I'd really like somebody to explain that to me. <laughs> I mean, often it doesn't do anything, but... Still, why take it and then not block? It's nuts, isn't it? Okay, I guess at least this he's got the... He's got always on the LOS, so... You know, there's a, there's an excuse from not having them on the LOS. Keep us a mighty blow for snots, yeah. That, that, it's fair enough this game. But... <laughs> but in other games, though... You know, like this one is a bad example, really. Ah, 
that's that's true, Sodan, and that's true. That is literally an argument that I've seen for not taking Mighty Glow before. It was in it was in OFL actually. It was in OFL people didn't want to take claw pommers because then they would take up all the blocks so they couldn't skill up their noble warriors. That that was why some people didn't take claw pom pestigors because they thought if the claw pom pestigors blitzing all the time, how will they get star player points on the noble warriors? And I'm like because you'll score touchdowns with them when the opponent has five players on the pitch. <laughs> <laughs> that was a pretty that was pretty obvious well he's not mainly LOSD it was a bad example of this guy to be fair to be fair to this chap yeah Fish finger. Oh, I could, I could, I could eat a fish finger. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yep. Yeah, that's very good reasoning. Very good reasoning, pseudo. No. Can't argue with that at all. Wow, six out of six bonehead passes. You don't see that every day. deep in case he does some kind of handoff or run around play but fuck it yeah I should have kept them deep shouldn't have the snots <laughs> yeah fair enough believe me Leader, hmm. Yeah, maybe. I'll would, I would take on a snotling double. I don't know. I think two rerolls is too many. I'd rather just save my. I'd rather just not use my one reroll than have two and just frivolously use one. break tackle in there. I mean, I should have known by his record he was just going to potato, shouldn't I? So I should have gone deep, especially as a moment five. Potato hammer. Oh, that's the ogre. <laughs> oh, wow, that's pretty amazing. Okay. So I can block the uh, free tackle free if I make all the boneheads. Fuck it.
Fuck. Alright, so the break tackling doesn't look so good now, does it? So I'll just hope dirt base, base, base the ball. him back dare to be stupid God, that'd be amazing, pseudo. That'd be amazing. I guess I should have put a snotling up his ass to make it. Hard to get the two D. Now it's really easy, isn't it? Fucking Shawnee. Oh man. <laughs> There's just no need for them. <laughs> Fuck's sake. <laughs> I can see why he's won a game. <laughs> Getting banged on for sure. Right, well, this is a very easy two dice on the ball, isn't it? Shame that this takes the recovery out, but um, it is what it is, isn't it?
screwed by the rain. Not a bad scatter though in the end. Oh, the cars. Fuck you, swordfish cunt. Just base it. <laughs> oh, dirt. Base, base, base. <laughs> nice getting the Kaz in. That, that's got to increase the chance of him conceding, hasn't it? Kaz in the mighty blow tackle. Hell of a Kaz. And hell of a scatter, yeah. Yeah, it is hard to... Like, you shouldn't care about Snotlings getting cast. But... I was slightly annoyed that you powered us with two guys. That you committed so much to get the two dice and then but got the power. No, I couldn't have gone there. No, I think I'd, I'd, I didn't want to get three dice by a point. Oh, and then he's failed to dodge into stun, which is a bit unlucky, isn't it? That's the, that's the fucking thing about Blood Bowl. It's easy for him to think he's getting unlucky when he's making bad plays. It's like letting somebody two dice his ball. Basically, with a, you know, really easily let those two dice the ball. So you can think that that's uh, unlucky. And then that, that just really was unlucky. But then maybe he shouldn't have made the play. But still, hmm. I don't know how easy the surf is here. TBH. I mean, I could push him and then break tackle but that's just fucking crazy I'd rather get rid of the ball like that. one two three four the skull <sighs> oh, I boneheaded are oh, you fucking prick I guess I just dodged him away and then blitzed with the block tackle. Oh, well, I fucked that up, didn't I? <laughs> Christ. That was really fucking bad. If I'd re-rolled it, I would have got the score. <laughs> I should have just moved him over. This probably will be his first win. Fuck's sake. This fucking team, man. Never lucky. That was that was really bad. Making a one instead of a two. 
I, I'll, I've thought about it said sooner. Well, not so much on humans, but on dwarves, because everyone else has got a block, haven't they? And he's kind of fast, so I think it's it's all right on dwarves. Right, you've got to get him there. Is the fucking the fucking safety? Three dice this guy. Glorious. Say one, two, three. We've got a GFI. Greed is good. Greed is right. Oh, Greed fucking. Oh, I can't count. Fuck's sake. Didn't have to GFI. Fuck it. I guess I should have just taken the push and then dodged him out to there. I'm just done now, to be honest. I guess I should have made the second GFI once I realised he couldn't reach. Because having him. Oh no, it stopped the 3 plus dodge on. But yeah, if I'd dodged him there, this would have been harder. So I was stupid to that ball down. I'm just fucking pissed off. Corsi pals. <sighs> Just playing shit. Oh wow. Well that was as good a good a scat as I could get. Eh? Shit. Piss me off. This team just pisses me off to be honest. <laughs> it was fun the first few games where everything was going great. Well I was just rolling dice like a pro. But now when every mistake is punished it's uh, it's getting less fun. I'm making lots of mistakes as well.
Yeah, maybe I should get the second reroll. Maybe I'd hate the. Maybe I'd hate everything less if I had an extra reroll. But I don't know. I'm getting to. I think I'm getting to the end of Ogres now. The end of my tether with Ogres. I think I'll play Chaos next. Next tomorrow and then. And then come back to the Ogres after that. Ah, so that, that's got the two for dodges, so that's why people think it, it works for dodges, doesn't it? See, people still have Hillier versus Block. I don't give a shit. Tackle. Let's fucking go. And he goes and throws him. And then he goes and throws him next turn or some bollocks like that. Nice. Yes, yeah, so I feel it's not good having that bit of a... <laughs> yeah, stopping him from scoring might be the best. You're right. One, two, three, four, five. He lobs him, he lobs him next turn. I mean, that, that works, doesn't it? <laughs> that actually works. <laughs> but it probably gives him more chance to score than it does me. To be fair. Should have probably just broke tackle away, shouldn't I? And then try to long bomb it to him or something next time. I don't know. Yeah, first I was going TV. I was going safe moves first all the time when I have no rerolls. Now that I've got one, I play a bit looser, which isn't good. So that's why I don't want to go to two, because then I'll, you know, I'll carry on. I just think you've got to focus up and play like you've got zero rerolls, and then only use it if it's like, you know, horrific.
<laughs> yeah, mana ray. It's a bit confusing, isn't it? Yes, I would like to dodge. Three five is all the needs. Not two three five. Wish you could throw. Wish you could throw a, a goblin twice in one turn. <laughs> that would be pretty good. I would like to have gone for the score, like, but wasn't likely, was it? So I'm sure it was right not to go for the score, but. Fuckhead. Can only follow the nearest guy. Oh, nice! Potato hammer got hammered. Apple fail. Glorious. I did sit on him. It was intentional. That's why That's why they play at St. Zunk's Park. And, uh, and their motto is best team since sliced bread. Was a worthwhile foul, wasn't it? Yeah, it's only, it's only space for one ogre. Oh, there's only space for ogres on one side here. Now there's no more confusion. Three, six, nine. That's not bad, is it? Oh, got him. He catches her a pin in the ass here. Oh, God, picking up in the rain is a nightmare for an over, isn't it? It's amazing, though. Casting the ogre, casting the mighty blow tackle, casting the guard. And then KOing the Mighty Blow didn't come back, so that was about as perfect a half as you could get look-wise. Very lucky. Very lucky, but I mean, he did. He did play very bad, but that was still incredibly lucky. That's the catcher, isn't it? Say hello to my little friend with blog tackle <laughs> and mighty blow. Okay, now. Another catcher, fuck's sake. This guy's a madman. Ten one is hidden. Hey, extra reroll. Oh fuck's sake! In the end zone, really. Three, six, nine, ten. Yeah, okay. Go for the armor eight guy first. 
armor seven, but you know, <laughs> he's fucking armor eight for reasons. Good. <laughs> Gary Shure salmon. <laughs> Gary Shure is fucking dead. <laughs> Yes! Yes! <laughs> Fuck off, you fearless fucking Fisher fucking fucks. Fearless Fisher fucks, that's what they should be called. Yes. Finally. Finally, the glorious fucking win needed a fucking concession at some point. Good. Oh wow. Ogre MVP. Flash is dead. But Thor gets a nice skill. 10 AV breaks. I mean he got battered that to be fair, he got fucking battered that game. He was unlucky with a Kaz. But um you know his positioning was awful, wasn't it? So he got in he got himself into those spots that even but then the dice were amazing. I can't lie. I can't lie. I was very lucky. I mean, that, that game there is why it's hard for new players, isn't it? Because you'd be looking at that game thinking he was completely fucking robbed of any chance, which he kind of, kind of was, wasn't he? I could go at the second reroll now. I just realised I had ordered them by star player points, but I'd actually just had the best player at the top. Because he was on block tackle. It's better than my poor guard, I think, isn't it? But he's not on the most star player points. I guess guard, get another guard. Stand firm's good, though. A stadium. I'm going to win playoffs with these ogres. I fucking doubt it. <laughs> I fucking know it. The best thing since prize bread because uh, VIP Kurgle, it's when Zunk said, uh, I am the best, better than everyone, or something like that. There you go, I'm the best. He's, he probably didn't say, There you go. He said something like, I'm the best of all time, and everyone else is scrubs. Which is why, um, which is why everyone else is scrubs. And uh, Zunk is a block ogre. I can't remember. He said, he said, I can't remember that someone clipped it. Shawnee, probably. <laughs> probably Shawnee. Oh, man. Oh, yeah, I did intend to pile on everything, yeah. I did intend to pile on everything. That was my intention. Just because it's fun. And it's the only way you're going to fucking win a game in the playoffs. So I guess I could start the pile on train now, couldn't I? <laughs> Being a black old man. <laughs> yeah, it's bound to be Shawnee. Getting himself banned for by clipping funny things. What a, what, what a sick bastard. <laughs> um, so yeah, I don't know where they get the re-roll. The second re-roll, it would make things a lot safer, wouldn't it? But it would make the team so much more TV. Okay, I'm trying to win with them. I am, really am trying to win. So getting guard for the block does make more sense than piling on, but then piling on is the only way you win against anyone who's got a brain. Just pile on with everyone and hope you slaughter his team. It is, isn't it? Three block ogres is, makes me kind of want to forget the piling on route and go with kind of actually trying to take them somewhat seriously. Um, I don't know. I really don't know. No, you don't know. <laughs> well, Skuro, that, that particular one, that particular clip, Skuro, that particular clip that got Shawnee banned, Andy Davo himself said, he's a lovely fella, Jim, and then laughed like he made the joke himself. So I don't know why he, uh, why he got offended by the joke. <laughs> <laughs> he got offended by his own joke being clipped, which is 
<laughs> Which is pretty fucking bizarre. To be honest, isn't it? <laughs> yeah, like fascist obsession, yeah. Yeah. The band Glippy put it in my Discord where where uh, where Randy Dave or well no when Zunk said where's your missus gone and then he said uh, he said she's gone to the gym and then he paused for a bit and then he said lovely chap Jim and then, no, I <laughs> and then Zunk said oh so if she comes back looking tired and sweaty you know what she's been doing or something like that and and then because Shawnee clipped it, he's a bad guy. I just don't know why. I don't know why. Panning on his series, yeah, it is good. It is good. Yeah, he said it. He said it. <laughs> like, I, don't, I just don't get why he was, why he would ban someone for clipping a joke you'd made. I don't know. If he hadn't made the joke himself. Fair enough, you know, fair fair enough, you might be like, ooh, you know. <laughs> fair enough, but it was weird that he made the joke himself, and Zunk had made the joke, and then... Ah, fair enough then, Tony. Fair enough, drop the re-roll. Nah, I don't know, I think, I think controlling TV isn't that important, which makes me think about getting the second one. I just don't know whether to go guard or piling on. Piling on is good. Like, obviously, piling on with an ogre is just fucking dumb because you want them to be stood up at all times. And it's bad enough that you're losing tackle zones with, with boneheads. So piling on is horrible. But if you've got four piling on ogres, then you can win the toss and actually do some fucking damage, can't you? Which is, uh, which is good. I don't know. I'll have to think about it for a short while. And we'll definitely have to buy... A another snotling. So yeah, another guard would be alright, wouldn't it? I wouldn't I wouldn't hate another guard. Right. Let's have a giveaway for a scrub. If anyone wants to be a scrub with a very short life expectancy. Um yeah, that makes that makes sense then, Tony. To be fair, yeah, I didn't think of I didn't think of that angle, but yeah, yeah, the piling on mummies, mental, isn't it? <laughs> I think <laughs> tension is ten assistant coaches. It is a blot. <laughs> it's a sweet team, really. Anyway, right, I'm gonna have a, a little break, even though it was a very short game. I uh, did I say stay fantastic? Yeah, I don't think I did. Probably didn't say stay fantastic. So, um, thanks for watching. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. And stay fantastic.